guys today is saturday and saturday belongs to bet investors so guys last round of matches are being played across so many legs so please make sure to bet wisely now speaking about bet i saw this article on the internet and this really struck me i was like hey is this really possible hmm? i was like is this really possible so a 19 year old boy in ghana here staked bet 10 cities and when he staked the bet, I mean that day, Oyibo cried. He won 900,000 Ghana cities. Titisikano, 9 billion. 9 billion. That is what the, the 19 year old boy won. Now, he was so excited. He was so happy. And then he decided to go home to tell the parents about the situation. Oh, mama, I've won 900,000. 900,000 Ghana cities. Our situation is about to change. Our, our, our destiny is going to change forever because this is this is what God has done for me. Told the father the same thing. Now the parents of this boy, the parents of the 19-year-old boy, are saying that they don't believe bet is a is a safe way to make money, and they believe betting is against their religion. So the boy should return the 900,000 that he has won from the betting company company back. I'm like, wow. <laughs> the question is, will you, will, you, will you return the money? What advice will you give to this 19-year-old boy? I mean, the situation is really strange because it, it looks as if they have given the boy an ultimatum. Either he returns the money or he leaves the house. Well, he's 19-year-old. He's still under his parents and he won 900,000 Ghana cities. If you convert it into dollars, Charlie, that is a lot of money. I think eighty thousand dollars or something like that. That is a lot of money. Nine billion. Will you return it back to the betting companies? So, guys, the ball is in your court. I want to know what you think about this, guys. Will you return the money? And also, what advice will you give to this nineteen-year-old boy that has won this money? And the parents are saying they believe betting is a sin, so he should return the money. They don't want any evil money in their house. What will you do? Let me know that down below in the comment section. Now, if you comment on that, uh, this video, I'll make sure to give you a shout out in our next video. Now, you're watching Sports Corner GH. Those who have not seen me before, or this is your first time watching Sports Corner GH, please. Yeah, we talk about sports. Uh, sports, moi. Sports way it be. Sports way, Charlie. You know, you, you hear like it will be. You hear. That is what we do here on Sports Corner GH. So if you have not yet subscribed, please make sure to subscribe. And those who have already subscribed, thank you very much. And God richly bless you. In fact, you are going to win bet today. You are also going to win 9 billion today. So guys, let's talk about um some few news items I picked on on the internet. Now let's start with Andre Dede Ayu. So Premier League has presented Andre Dede Ayu with... An award for making 100 appearance in the English Premier League. I think this is a very great milestone when it comes to Andre Ayu across three teams. Swansea, West Ham and then Nottingham Forest. So we are going to look at how many matches he played for these teams. The impact he had with these teams. And you know, I believe Andre Ayu is one that needs to be celebrated. He has really done a lot for Ghana, he has done a lot for all the teams he has played in. Even though Nottingham Forest is not getting you know, some to play. I mean, Nottingham Forest signed over 30 players. Not all of them are getting you know, opportunity to get game time. But the whole thing is, Andre Ayu has reached 100 in EPL um, game appearance. So, so Andre Ayu in 2015 at Swansea City, he made 46 appearances for the team he was very young they're very energetic so you you understand yeah making a lot of no waves in the english premier league at west ham he made 43 appearances at west ham he made 43 appearances and then at nottingham forest just recently he made 12 appearances making it a total of 100 appearance in the english premier league he was being re rewarded now he becomes the fifth Ghanaian to achieve this milestone the fifth Ghanaian to achieve this milestone and big ups to andre dede ayu capital one capital one 
So guys, let's move on from Andre Ayu and let's talk about Abdul Salih Samet. Abdul Salih Samet plays for RC Lons in the French League and now he has been named in the GFFN's team of the season for French League A 2022-2023 season. You know, aside that, he has been ranked 8th for passes completed, accumulating to 91.8%. Now, Arsenal are going to play Champions League football next season with Abdul Salih Samet, midfield maestro, midfield general, midfield Yami. He's very good. I mean, we have talked about him several times. Abdul Salih Samet doing wonderful work, especially in the middle, especially that his telepathic relationship with Thomas Party. I mean, we can't wait to see Abdul Salih Samet play for the Black Stars. But this milestone is a very huge one for someone who just walked into a team for just a season, uh, a season and then changed the fortune of, of, of the team. Now, Arsenal are going to play Champions League football next season. I mean, this is crazy. This is crazy. And I, 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 if, if, if some team comes to buy Abdul Salih Samed, he shouldn't move. He should play one more season with Arsenal. He should play the Champions League with them. He should shine. And I believe he's going to shine. As for Black Star players, where did they ball, where did they shine, they did they, they, they do all, uh, and they love them. Uh, Abdul Salih Samet, solid guy, solid midfielder. So that is uh, another great milestone for a Ghanaian uh, player, a Black Star player. So guys, let me know what your thoughts are on these three stories. One, the 19-year-old um, who won 900,000 with 10 CDs and he, the confusion with the parents. If we were in the guy's shoes, what would you do? What advice will you give to this 19-year-old? Because honestly, if it was me, <laughs> uh, you know what? I'll just leave the house and I'll go and spend the money well, well. Yes, I'll spend it. And I'll put 200,000 graphics. I'll only do it to buy 100,000. 100,000. If you're 900,000. I'll run in your coupon. Tell I mean, let me know your thoughts on this issue down below. Also, Andre, are you reaching 100 appearance in the English Premier League? Huge milestone. He's the fifth Ghanaian player to do so. Let me know your thoughts on that also down below in the comment section. And also, Salis Abdel Samet being named in French League as team of the season. Very solid. Very solid guy. Let me know your thoughts on that also down below in the comment section so guys that's all we have for you for today don't forget to like subscribe turn on notification charlie if you turn on notification eh you go in bed me i tell you you go in bed to our guys my name is Adam. i'll catch you in the next video have a happy weekend pow